Today, I am making Gohan fish curry. This is made with Alaskan Pollock and is perfect for a night in front of the TV. So first, I'm going to make a, a curry paste, a, a very easy, uh, a quick one. So we're going to, we got a mortar. That could also be done in a, in a Robocoop. Okay, so I got a couple of garlic cloves, which I will smash a little bit in the mortar. Then I'm going to grate some ginger. It's better to grate because you get all the juice coming out. Then some chili. So I'm still pie. Just squash this until you get a puree. Then I'm going to add a tablespoon of ground coriander, a teaspoon of cumin seed, half a teaspoon of turmeric, and a tablespoon of uh, tamarind paste. And again, incorporate all this to the mix. So what you want is a, a nice puree. That's one of the quickest way to do a curry paste. So if you are courageous, if you are courageous, you just have a little taste. But it's, it could be very strong. Very good. We're going to make a go and fish curry using Alaskan Pollock, which is a sustainable fish. Uh, so I have cut the pollock into uh, chunky pieces. I'm going to season each pieces and just sea salt and black pepper. Then we're going to start the the, the going sauce. A little bit of oil in a pan. We're going to fry the onions. The goan, the goan cooking in India is one of the best cooking uh, methods for fish. So the onions are nice fry, golden brown. So now I'm going to add uh, the chili, a little bit of chili. I done a mix of red and green chili. You don't want too much because then I'm going to add the curry paste, which is quite spicy as well. So some curry paste. Then you just fry this nicely. A little bit of ground coriander. You can add a little bit more oil if you wish, just to fry this. Then we'll add the tomatoes. So we got the coconut milk, then I'm going to season a little bit. Sea salt, black pepper. I'm going to taste it. Mm -hmm. Very good, then now we're going to put the Alaskan Pollock portion in there. This is need to simmer for a while. Just going to lead it and simmer very slowly. Also, you could put this in an oven in a medium heat with a lid on, and that will be perfect. Now I'm going to check the grand fish curry that's been cooking for about five minutes. Very good. So now I'm going to add some chopped coriander and a little bit of seasoning. You don't want to break the pieces of fish too much. I'm going to have a taste. Very good. That's perfect. We're going to plate the go and fish curry. You could serve this with uh, boiled rice, steamed rice, and uh, a piece of uh, naan bread. So we're just going to Okay. 
Well, I just, just a, a little, again, half a lime, a little bit more of chopped coriander. Here you have uh, Goan fish curry made with uh, Alaskan pollock. <laughs> 